Mel Dingle, Eden Taylor Draper, was furious in tonight's Emmerdale, as devious Al Chapman, Michael Wildman, stole her business proposal. Ambitious Belle has been keen to go up in the world, hoping to expand her horizons as she works at the BB. Spotting the potential of wellness retreats in the current climate, Belle put together a business plan and presented it to boss Eric Pollard, Chris Chittill. She was also pleased when Al read through her carefully constructed research and praised her, taking his encouragement as a well-needed boost of confidence. He even offered to look over her plans. But as Al continued to struggle to find a job following his constant scheming last year, he was merely looking out for himself. Belle was deflated when Eric told her he wouldn't be moving ahead with her ideas, although seeing her so upset did prompt him to tell her she shouldn't give up on her aspirations. Meanwhile, Al was over at home farm, passing off Belle's work as his own. Kim agreed to look over Al's idea, but Jai Sharma, Chris Bisson, was put out to hear about their meeting. Later, Jai overheard Belle and Charles Dingle, Lucy Pargeta, talking about Belle's failed attempt to update the BB, and alerted her to the fact that Al had stolen her idea. As Jai watched on smugly, Belle confronted Al, who tried to worm his way out of trouble by casually lying that he had put in plenty of work to. Belle refused to accept his blatant plagiarism, while Al couldn't care less that he had angered yet another member of the Dingle clan. We know that his feud with Kane is far from over, as Emma Dale has teased a dramatic car chase between the pair that seems to be the catalyst for a potentially explosive stunt. Producer Jane Hudson previously revealed that Alan Kane will have a huge showdown. I think we can probably tease in our special week that Kane and Al's feud is definitely not over, as we will see in that special week and something will happen that will make those two have to look at their relationship with each other. So, there's definitely going to be an explosive Kane slash Shell moment in our special week. I think the audience are really enjoying these two men constantly at war. We also know that Belle is set to team up with Al professionally in a surprising turnaround. But how will that turn out? And just how far will Al go in his vendetta against the Dingles?